just past the midpoint of the 2015 Formula Drift season. And overall for me, 2015 so far has been a super fun year. So we started 2015 out in a really fun way. I went out and debuted my prototype competition Ford Mustang RTR. We took it to a frozen lake and went out there and drifted the car on the ice. Just made a really fun launch video sharing what will become basically the development vehicle for my new Ford Mustang that we will debut next year in the Formula Drift Series. That same weekend, I also competed in a ice race with a bone stock EcoBoost Ford Mustang. All in all, it was a really good way to start out the year and uh, it was a lot of fun. So last year we built and debuted the Ultimate Fun Haver, which is a Ford F-150 EcoBoost that we built into the Ultimate Fun Haver. It drifts, it jumps, it's got five racing seats for myself and all my friends, and I've just been having an absolute blast with it this year. Took it to Hoontown, got crazy on their dirt track, launched it off some jumps, took it to Nitto Enthusiast Day, and had a blast with that, gave a bunch of people rides. Just after New Jersey, I went to the Bro Down at E-Town Raceway, Englishtown, New Jersey. Really been using that thing for everything that it's worth and everything we built it for. And I'm pretty amazed how much power it puts out and how much of my right foot it can handle. It's just been a good time. The Formula Drift season for us has been, what can I say, is one of those years that you get in motorsport. Long Beach, my opponent made some contact. I made a big mistake after that contact and we got knocked out of the round. Uh, going into Atlanta, my team and I, I think, pushed a little bit too hard on, on tire wear and uh, caught us out on our second battle against Kenny Moen. I over-rotated in the second to last turn, throwing us out of that round. Formula Drift Orlando in the crazy conditions. I decided to push a little bit too hard against my man Chris Forsberg in the grade eight. Made a little bit of contact with him, knocked us out of the competition. I'm moving into Jersey round four. Had a killer lead run against Dean Carney. And then in the chase run, I basically just made a stupid mistake, took us out of that round. So here we are in Seattle. And I'm tired of the, the drama and, and tired of not being where you know we work to be and, and where we deserve to be. So hoping to turn that around. And I hate our results on the track not being a reflection of our effort on and off the track. It's just one of those years that you're like chasing yourself and looking deep within to find out you know where the issues are and try to figure out like what is the thing that needs to change. And it's like our Mustang's on point, my team's on point. I feel super focused and mentally clear and it's tough you know it's tough to look within and and find the flaws but uh there's no doubt that we have some and we're just gonna figure it out so all in all it's been a pretty killer year so far you know we've ice racing ice drifting jumping in the ultimate fun ever formula drift a street driven tour and hyperfest with my man chris forsberg and ryan turk just stacking it in three car tandem with ride alongs nitto enthusiast day st louis auto show and uh we got plenty more so I really appreciate all the love and everyone uh, coming out and saying what's up. Make sure you keep up with Monster Energy and me on Instagram or Facebook for all the fun we'll be having the rest of the year. And make sure you stop by, say what's up, and throw me a high five at any events we'll be at. See y'all soon.